Yeah, I love Three Minute Thesis. It's my favourite event of the year. so inspiring to see all this amazing research that makes you feel really hopeful about the world and the, our capacity as humans to address some of these huge problems. Contestants must adhere to the three minute time limit. They can only use one static slide and no props are allowed. It's amazing to hear what people are doing um, across such a vast area um, but also to describe their research in three minutes. Take a look at this image on the top left side. It's a car. It's one of our dream cars. Yes, I'm talking about driverless cars. I'm able to make nanoparticles which have a huge appetite for greenhouse gases. They feast on greenhouse gases, digesting them to produce fuels which are cleaner and greener than the fossil fuels we rely on today. I've discovered a new family of viruses never before found in cane toads. Circoviruses are a causative agent of disease in pigs and birds, but the pathological potential in the cane toad is not known. Leading a world first trial, we at St Vincent's Hospital and UNSW have successfully replaced the mitral valve in human beings without stopping the heart and without using a heart lung machine. My results suggest that independent auditing can assist charities to produce more transparent and reliable information in accordance with the reporting standards so that users have more credible information about charities' activities such as how much donation the charity has received and how it has utilised its fundings. Tonight, we have three schools representing the Aspire program as VIP guests. Aspire is a UNSW outreach program that works with school students to support their educational aspirations. Oh, there's no better night of entertainment. There's were so many interesting stories, personal stories. I felt really invested in a lot of these stories. You could see what's at stake. It's not about dumbing it down, it's about really explaining things in lay terms. So the research is absolutely important. But I think also the engagement with the audience, the communication skills, and I think the, the, other, the other thing is, is that sort of personalised, personal touch. So actually being able to bring the research story to the people. <laughs>